Good morning, guys. Scotty here. It's October 6th today. Not actually too bad a day. We've had some rain for the past week or so and I haven't been able to do anything, but I was out tonight. I've been checking up on some nukes. They're not doing too bad. Uh, hive 2 here swarmed way back September 6th. Uh, I've got to look at the actual swarm here in a few minutes. Um, I went through this immediately after it swarmed. I found virgin queens galore. I made a whole bunch of splits. At the moment it looks like about half of them. I think I found 12 virgin queens. I was just checking up on nukes. Um, at the moment it looks like about six of them are mated in lane. It's a long shot whether they're going to survive the winter. It's a long shot whether this one's going to survive the winter. Um, I was back in here uh, September September 22nd was the last time I was in here. So today's August, October 6th. Uh, a few dead bees up here. Sometimes they get in and I don't really know how they get in. But uh, they do get in. Um, I do have my marking pin, yes. Depending on what kind of a mood they're in, I may or I may not even catch a marker. I'm, I'm just more interested to see if they've got a laying queen and then I'll make a decision. I'll make a decision what I'm going to do once I see that. Let me check this inner cover. Put that out front. See what kind of a mood they're in and then I'll make a decision what I'm going to do here. I haven't decided yet whether I want to, so it's just a frame of foundation. They're drawing it a little bit. I haven't decided yet whether I want to put this upstairs or whether I want to try and add some resources to the top of this and leave it out here. Um, don't know just yet. It's just a frame of drawn foundation. It would have been a, it's got the, 19, uh, the 20 on it. Well, this side's got capped honey. The other side, they're just drawing it. And drawing it nice too, actually. I don't see any. I haven't been feeding this one, so I'm not. I don't see any syrup there. Just a. They haven't given me any warnings or anything, but just give them a little smoke, just to keep them, keep them from getting up in my face. See polished cells, but the bees have got it covered pretty good. A hard time looking down. Oh, there's our queen, and she definitely looks mated. I do have that close-up camera running, but I don't know if you'll catch her. She's she right in the center. She's right in the center of that frame right now. <sighs> she certainly does look mated. I'm just going to sit her at here at the back. Probably going to mark her regardless whether I see eggs or not. But I'd really like to see some eggs. If there's going to be eggs, it should be on this frame. This side's, this side's nectar. And there are, without a doubt, eggs. All right. Oops, got one crawling up my pant leg. <laughs> Not going to end well for anybody. All right, where'd you go, sweetie pie? Good number of bees here. Don't remember what side, and I didn't take note. Oh, there she is. Big caramel one with a black tip. She's a big queen. She's burrowing in underneath a bunch of bees. She's just a buzzing like crazy. She's not happy with me. Understandable.
Now I had one fly earlier today, so we aren't going to fool around too much with that. All right, put this back together. Gently push those. So I got some gap here, so the next time I go to get this, I've got some room to pull that back. That is wonderful. Now, is this hive out of the woods? No, long ways from it. Awful, awful late in the year to be building winter bees. Um, same as all those nukes, and I'm fully aware of it. Um, I'm not going to worry about it too much. I'm going to go and check the, the hive, the swarm that came from this. It's also in a 10 frame box, good number of bees. If that one doesn't have a, a laying queen, last time I was in it, queen was the exact same status as this. Uh, it wasn't seeing any eggs or larvae. Right? I may unite these two together. Um, if not, this one's probably going upstairs. I won't, I won't leave a single outside here for the winter. Uh, I think it'll be a separate video. So anyway, Appreciate your time, guys. Thanks for watching. You guys be good to your bees, and I'm sure it'll be good to you. We'll talk to you soon.